Woo, those are some bright blue shoes. Welcome to Man Cave Media. Today I am checking out a pair of New Balance Fresh Foam BB V2s. Uh, this pair of shoes was purchased by my father and he had them sent straight to my house so that I could review them. And the, uh, the colorway is a little wild, I gotta say. Uh, I kinda dig them. Uh, the official colorway of these is Cyber Jade with pixel green and black. And I had a little peek already and Oh my goodness, uh, without further ado, let's get these out of the box, shall we? So we could take a closer look at exactly what my dad has purchased here. You can see like the color radiating through the paper. <laughs> this is a bright pair of sneakers. Oh my gosh, look at this thing. Sneaker number one. Goodness gracious. And sneaker number two. My apologies. And I think this is just padding. Yeah. Nothing else in the box. Keeping it simple. Keeping it real. All right, here they are in all their glory. The New Balance Fresh Foam BB V2. And uh, wow. That is a blue shoe. Like, that's a blue shoe. I, my first impressions, I, I kind of dig it. Uh, overall, like the, the silhouette of the sneaker, like I can do without that neon hit on the midsole. Um, but otherwise, like the green in the New Balance logo uh, against the blue and the translucent outsole it works. It works. Um, I could just, you know, less of this, less, less of that. But anyway, on the outside of the shoe, we have the New Balance logo. As I mentioned, there's some hits of neon green in there behind the white, uh, in front of the white rather, sorry. And also with some black splashed in there. Uh, the upper feels like it's leather. Is that real leather? Uh, so the upper gives the appearance of leather, but it's not. Uh, according to New Balance's website, it is a full synthetic upper but they did a good job of making it look like leather. Uh, I gotta give them props there. Let's see, on the midsole, it's almost the same color as the upper, but they got like this splash of like highlighter green. Like someone gave a highlighter to a kid and they just went nuts, <laughs> uh, is the best way to explain it. On the uh, inside of the shoe, no New Balance logo present. It's all that solid blue upper. Uh, it does say New Balance, really small right here by the, by the laces. And uh, there's more uh, hits of black. And then on the midsole, there's more of that, uh, that highlighter splash, I'm gonna call it, a splash of highlighter. Uh, on the toe box, there's more of that black present. The material on the toe box is, is pretty soft that synthetic material. Uh, the black almost feels like suede. And then the, around the front of the toe box, it's more of that synthetic leather. Uh, moving up the, through the tongue, it's like a mesh material with uh, some hits of black and more hits of green. And it looks like it's pretty breathable. The laces they come with are the same color as the upper, but they got some splash of white in there to kind of break it up. Moving around to the heel, we got more of that same blue color, but we have some translucent black. It's like a smoky gray, almost. Um, that, you know, it doesn't function as a pull tab, but it's in the area where a pull tab would be. But it's not a functional, I mean, I guess you could. My finger doesn't fit in there. Um, but I mean, it's not sewn down. So you could grab a hold of that and pull it if you wanted to, but I don't consider that to be very functional. Um, that's just my opinion though. Um, the outsole is semi-translucent, which is really cool. It's a nice touch on this shoe. And you have this like hit of this highlighter green right at the midfoot. On the inside of the sneaker, oh, sorry, I missed this on the top of the tongue. You have a, a white New Balance logo 
And then it says uh, New Balance. It says NBFFBB V2 in white and black on the top of the tongue. My apologies, I missed that. On the inside of the sneaker, the insole is black. And you've got fresh foam written in neon green. I'll get close up to that with my small camera. And that is pretty much it. Um, it is a you know pretty simple design, nice and clean, very bright, pops. Like my camera's most likely not doing it justice. When you when you see it in hand, it's like, pow, that is a very bright blue. Uh, mixed in with that neon green. It's really nice. So these feature a full length dual density fresh foam X midsole and they have an internal TPU plate at the midfoot. So that's what you're seeing right here uh, for extra stability. From my experience, um, I have a few pairs of New Balance. From my experience, fresh foam is pretty comfy on foot. So um, I don't doubt that these are comfortable. So according to the website, they have a unique hexagonal tread pattern. I don't know how unique it is. I haven't seen it before, but it's there. It's kind of cool looking. It goes well with the whole package. It also says it has a speed lacing system, which all I can see different, instead of the standard um, eyes for the laces, you have uh, like these, these uh, hooks almost like not hooks, but loops. You have loops that you put the laces through. And then once you get up towards the top of your foot, you have these like sleeves for your laces. That's the only thing that I see different. Um, so that's speed lacing technology, apparently. Uh, up near the top by your ankle, they have a standard eye for the lace. Okay, uh, retail for these is $129. Uh, there are plenty in stock in this color. Currently uh, a full size run. So from men's size five to men's size 14. <laughs> uh, but anyways, uh, sitting in a full size run currently on the website for $129. So uh, that being said, without further ado, let's go ahead and get some close ups of these beauties. Unfortunately, no on feet. These are not mine and um, way too big for me anyway. All right, that's all I have for this one. Thank you again for stopping by. Please smash that like button if you enjoyed this video and help feed that algorithm. I hope you have a great afternoon, and like always, thank you for watching.